Hi guys, today I will be doing a review on a mod called, wait, what was it called again? Um, I did install some other mods with it, you can see them here, and yeah, there will be, I'm sticking to my roots, okay? Immersive portals, we will be reacting to immersive portals, so let's get into the video. Got what button I set for pause. Let me just go into there. Pause this real quick. Oh yeah, happy Halloween guys. It, it, at the time of recording this, it, this is Halloween for me. Probably gonna post this like tomorrow or the day after. I'm gonna try and get it out the same day, but this will be a landmark so you guys know when I called this so you can see how long it actually takes me to record a video because I am so lazy. Anyway, let's get back to the video. Okay, fair note to you all. Don't just install a bunch of mods, wait the next day and then use them all at once without thinking there's going to be a problem. So let's delete that one. You know what, I'm just going to delete every single one that I don't really need for this video. You know, that clears things up and makes it a bit easier. I might need this one, and I know it's not the one that's causing the problem. Okay, yeah, let's see if that works yay it is open we can now get to the actual video of reviewing immersive portals just saying i do have a bit of experience not much just a bit as you can see i was kind of playing around with it yesterday but let's get to the video Okay, I am going to show you guys the setting up of this world. So I'm going to do, it's going to be overworld. Uh, what? Uh, uh, wait, what? No, I don't want nether up there. Can I configure? Let's remove. Oh, I know. I want that under there. Then overall sky island and void. Let's add end. So now it goes nether, overworld, overworld sky island one, and... You know what would be funny? Is if we add overworld at top, so then if we keep on going, or, yeah. You know what, let's just remove, done, finish. Okay, yep, yep. And I will name this re for review. Yay, so creative. Now let's get to the video. Okay, let's get to it. So if any of you guys don't know what immersive portals is, which are, by the end of this video, you're gonna figure out it out anyway. Essentially portals, blah, blah, blah. Do whatever you want and with those portals that are very immersive as it says in the name you'll figure it out and off to the lag session and and why that's happening let's do some ASMR. yeah i'm gonna remove that from the actual video I, i'm not having that in there i'm gonna remove that from the actual video yep I will remove that. 
Um, yeah, that was a bad idea. <sighs> By the end of this, I'm gonna have a hunchback. I forgot to stop. I forgot to start stopwatch. You know what? I'm glad I don't have my face in these things. You know what? That we'll just go in here and wait for that to stop lagging. So, if you guys didn't know, Portal Block, or Portal Helper, we'll use a little bit of that, and this, the oh so great wand of imagination where you can create a portal. You know what, I don't know where I'm going for th with this. Do you? Because I don't. You know, that's always you need for now. By the end of this, my help bar is going to be full. So, yeah, lucky. We have a village. This is still very laggy. Okay, let's create our first portal. So, if you didn't know, portal block makes portal. This, well, technically, if you use this, make it into a shape of another portal or whatever portal you want. Place another portal the same size. It will recreate. It will link those portals. And if you get flint and steel, there. Go over to a window. Not sure if it works as panes, but yep, it works as panes. <gasps> what hat? Oh, there. For a second, I thought I was bald. No, I'm not. Yeah, look, look at him. Bleeding off the chin. Perfect. Yeah, oh, I forgot I don't actually have a body. Okay, let's create our first portal. I use a portal helper because that's what most people start with to create a portal. Boop, boop, what up? Fly. Fly, mortal, fly. It's lagging that much. Mortals can't fly, by the way. So there's our first portal. Oh, majestic. You know what? We're not even going to create the other portal because I just remembered we don't have to because it'll just randomly select the spot. A portal to nowhere? Who would have guessed? There's the portal. There I go. Falling to the floor. So, pretty simple mechanics. Like, you guys can figure it out. Honestly, I think it's a good mod. It's not too hard to use, actually. You just have to be good at reading, which I am not. So let's delete that portal because that's not helping my world generation at all. Also, if you didn't, if you wanted to know, which you probably didn't, you can get rid of the mirrors by getting rid of the portal behind it. Wow. So, so hard to find oh yeah if you have a different mod I will share I will figure out a way to share links in the bottom so I'll just use this so you guys can get a representation let's just do it to one second oh, dang it I had to 
Okay. So let's do it from there to there. Straight up. So it's above my head. Yeah, that'll work. Now, the magic can happen. We're gonna make a one by one. Ta da! One by one, not fully touching the floor because I couldn't be bothered to fix it. Man, that's kind of hard to see. Like, if you line it up correctly, done. Anyway, it's possible to line those things up correctly. So, here's the portal. It's like a window. But, this window, you can walk through and get small. See, the grass is huge, and I'm small. If I go back through portal, I become human size again. Wow! I know what that is. An immersive portal. Half of you won't even ever figure out how to use. Anyway, let's get back to the video. Come on, not this glitch again. I have to delete every single portal. Well, with these glitches, you can actually do something kind of fun. Okay. I do not know what to create. I'm gonna lower my render distance. It's probably not even that high. Render distance. Ten chunks. Mm, no, eight chunks. Nine chunks. Mm, ten chunks. Done. That hopefully made it slightly better. Also, if I create a nether portal. I'll show you how to get to the nether by building down if you really want. Guess what? If I get this wrong. Mojang, make Minecraft less laggy. Oh, yay, I can fly again. I'm pretty sure it was four up. Two across. And then back up to the top. Yay, the worst nether portal that any of you have ever seen. Eh? Why is there two fires? Duh! Well, particles are going everywhere. Probably not helping with the loading process. Yeah, not helping at all. So anyway, why that loads? I haven't seen this happen in anyone else's videos. I wonder why. Have you got it? Here's the, 
Have you guys ever wondered how Lego sounds on a microphone? But today you can figure it out. Grab a piece of Lego. Two pieces, actually. And... Another wall. Isn't that what guys what guys isn't that what you came for? That looking into another wall? That's essentially the same on both sides. Well let's walk through. No, I don't wanna go deeper. I'm leaving. Bye. You know what? We do need to go deeper. And to do that, you need to dig. Let's go to the nether. Hear those footsteps and those reverb sounds? So as we approach the deeper chunks, you will slowly realize we change into deep slate. You see the, that red particles at the bottom? That's because it's still loading the nether. Surely we're close by now. Oh, I run through diamonds. And we reach obsidian. Keep on digging. What do we reach? The nether. Yeah, I know. So surprising. You know, I would have never seen this coming. Now what if we go up? Hmm? Is there a different way to make me fly? Sure, just it, it slash to fly. You know what? I'm gonna do that because I'm sick of having to double tap to damn fly. Trolls. Sprint. Sort of jump off. Yay. Mm -mm, tap. Okay, I don't know how to. There was cute vines, wasn't it? It's a cute vines. Gameplay. Okay. Turns out there's no hotkey for. The worst Minecraft player that ever lived. Okay, we're approaching 13 minutes of actual gameplay. And soon we will we'll reach the 13 minutes. And I will then work on posting this video. Have fun. Because this is a very boring video. As I fly into the unmoving sky, we will eventually reach what I call the end. And what you call the end. See what I didn't do there? Because it's not the beginning. Ah, look at that empty sky as we approach the mine shafts and floating water. Yeah, that's normal. Is this world two? Oh, it's a sky island stuff. Except I thought it would be smaller. You know, they get sky island. My country. I just decided to dig in the worst place, didn't I? 
Sky Islands. You can get this instead of the Aether mod. Wow. Bye, cows. Bye, bye, random Savannah. After this video, I'll come back and burn you all down. And I will stick to my word. Uh, look at the unmoving sky that only moves as long as the sun does. Whoa. That was quick. Don't look down, folks. You will die from surprise. Oh, so we just appear at a random end island, do we? Oh, no, it just spawns the end island, I guess? Except, I don't see... Well, of course I don't see, I'm not meant to yet. Oh, there it is. Why is this all here? I'll give you one clue. I have no idea. Anyway, this is where I will end the video today. If you guys want me to either continue into a deeper look at the Immersive Portals mod, also Ender Dragon, please be quiet while I do my outro. Or want me to do any other mod reviews that aren't weird, Trust me, I will not be doing any weird things. I will get around to it, because none of you ever comment on my damn videos! Mm. Bro, you were meant to stop when I clicked the button.